Now, it isn't the most beautiful thing in the world, but damn, it's efficient. In this video, I'm going to show you how to build the best possible sugarcane farm that you can in Minecraft 1.19. But before I show you that, I just want to say that only 1.6% of my viewers are actually subscribed. So if you're new here, make sure you're subscribed and you drop a like on the video. It's free and you can always unsubscribe later. All right, onto the tutorial. To make this farm, here are all the materials that you will need. Now the block type doesn't really matter, it's just for style. However, you do need full glass, just to make sure you don't lose any of the sugar cane over the edge. Now before we start, this farm can be built literally anywhere, be above ground or underground. But if you do build it in a swamp, it does increase the rates. So you might want to invest some time into finding a swamp biome. To start, we're going to go ahead and mine a three by one hole right here in the ground. And in this hole, we're just going to go ahead and place our double chest and our hopper face into the chest like this. Now go ahead and get your blocks and your sand right in front of the hopper. And, you know, obviously over, you're going to go ahead and place a block and then place it upside down the stairs right across the chest like this. Then away from the hopper, you're going to go ahead and place eight blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven, and eight. And I went in here and expand the land just so I have room to build this. Then on the other side, I'm gonna do the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Then finally at the very end, I'm gonna place one more block and just cut it off like so. And then going back the other way, you're gonna take out your sand and go at 17 blocks back in this direction, or you know, all the sand if you have 17. And it should line up like so, and then block it off once again. Now take your water buckets and on each side go ahead and place one water bucket source so that the water flows into the hopper like this. Then on the back side you're going to go ahead and place a two block high wall across the entire back. And your farm should look kind of like this right now. Now let's get into the redstone. Pick a side, any side, it doesn't really matter. Go ahead and build two blocks higher like this. And then take out your observer and you want to place it so that the face faces into the farm like this. After you've done that, grab your pistons and along the wall, you're going to go ahead and place down eight pistons in a row. Then you're going to skip a block right in front of the hopper. And then you're going to place eight more pistons down again. And now it should look a little bit like this. Go ahead and take out your blocks once again and right across the pistons, place one block down. And once you meet up with the observer, place down three blocks, kind of like so around it. Now take out your redstone dust and leading out of the observer, place down your redstone dust like so. Then place eight redstone on top of the pistons. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Place down your repeater, which once again, line up with the hopper. And then place down eight more redstone dust. Now, if you ever do need to check to make sure these pistons work, just place a block in front of your observer. And as you can see, the last piston went off, so it does indeed work. Now, inside, you can go ahead and place down all your sugar cane, if you so please. So I'm gonna go ahead and place down my 16 right now, but you do still need to place your glass in front. Now, I know this may seem weird, but yes, you do actually need to place this glass down because if you don't, then the sugar cane is just going to get stuck on the bricks right here. So go ahead and enclose the area in however you want. You know, I'm going to do it kind of like this and I'm going to grab my glass and I'm going to place a too high block wall right across it. So at the very end, your build should look like this. And if you need to go ahead and test it, you can just place down some random sugar cane if you have extras and then just place another sugar cane in front of the observer and boom it goes right into the water and into the chest and you are finished that is all for this tutorial but before you leave make sure to go ahead and check out my 45 facts about minecraft 1.19 video and make sure to join the discord linked in the description below have a great day